my gosh, you guys are just crazy. Are you hungry? Yeah, that's what I thought. Wow. Good. Wonderful. Beautiful. Morning, audience. Do you guys see what I'm seeing? Do you see these two dogs playing? You playing with her? Memphis, are you playing with her? Look at that tail just to go on. She's like, I am the happiest pup around the planet. Hi, Kira. Kira's like, I'm taking a break. Oh, nope, she's coming after you too, Kira. She's coming after you too. Like, I gotcha. Oh my goodness. So we finally got another good break in the weather. It's, whoa, be careful. It's not as humid today. It's still a little warm. It's still like in the 80s though. So hard to take the dogs out and do too much without worrying about them overheating, you know, besides playing in the pool and stuff in the backyard. Whew. But maybe we'll take them for an R-I-D-E later today. You can see that they're feisty. You can, you can tell that they're all feisty and they all want to play. All of them. All right, quit nibbling on her ear. Quit picking on her. Get her, Memphis. Get her, Memphis. Oh my goodness. These girls are waiting on their lunch. I think what's happening right now is we're gonna feed them lunch and then Jamie and I might take off on the bike and go out to lunch at a spot. I don't know if I've ever taken you guys to. Maybe I have, because I've been there a few times with my mom, but we're gonna take you to this cool lunch spot that we're gonna go to. Oh my gosh, you guys are just crazy. Are you hungry? Yeah, that's what I thought. Your food's almost ready. <laughs> yeah, almost. Not quite, but almost. You wanna go outside? Wanna go outside and get some of this energies out? Let's do that. Okay, you ready? Ready? Three, two, one. Go, 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 go! Full speed run, oh my gosh, look at that dirt. Look out, Kira, she's coming for ya! Eleanor's like, I don't have to go to the bathroom, I need to play. Let everybody go to the bathroom. Jesus, Pete. Woo! So in case this turns into a massive bruise, which it really feels like it could, I just punched myself in the face trying to knock this giant bug. I think it was a wasp. Like it came at my face and I did one of those and the knuckle, go me. I bruise easily, so I might have a black eye from that. I can feel it. I should probably go put, I'm gonna go put ice in that. That's probably a good idea. Gee, it's like you girls know that your food is about ready. Are you ready for food? Are you done being crazy? You ready to go eat some food? All right, let's go inside and eat some food. I gotta get some ice. Let's see if I don't get a bruise. I gotta tell Jamie what happened. <laughs> okay, you have, no, ma'am, get over there. Okay, you have had your lunch. I know, be good. We'll be back in just a little bit and then we'll go do something fun with you. Deal? Deal, 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 deal. Yeah, so Jamie and I decided to come out to lunch, which we apparently have been doing more often. Yeah. And we thought we should probably show you guys one of the coolest Coney Island places in Alpena, considering, well, it's the only Coney Island place in Alpena, but like, can you tell why we like this place? <laughs> can you can you figure it out? Like even on the menu? Yeah. They got all the good red wing stuff all over the walls. So cool. It's in the cup. Yeah, they got a lot of cool stuff here. Another big sign behind me. Mm -hmm. We have some of this stuff at yeah, our house. Yeah, there's a few things here that we Yeah, have. there's a couple, there's a handful. Yeah. Like we have that right there. Yeah, and the wing nut below it. We do, we have the wing nut below it. So we've got some of the same stuff, but we're getting some Coney dogs and some onion rings and it should be a good lunch. Mm -hmm. we'll yeah, we'll show you when it comes out. So those of you that aren't from Michigan, do you even know what a Coney dog is? Because I've been told that like, Co no, no seriously, man, really? I've been okay. told that Coney dogs are really like a Michigan thing. There's like a, a Detroit style Coney dog, huh. a Flint style Coney dog, but that Coney Islands and Coneys are like a Michigan thing. So do you guys even know what I'm talking about when we talk about this? I'm curious, how many of you not only know what it is, but have had one before? So this, well, I guess I should show yours because yours is traditional. That's a traditional Coney dog. Right. Must Onions and coney sauce. Right, you know, where I don't get onions on mine, but I get onion rings, which made Jamie laugh at me. <laughs> so we're gonna eat some food. So we took a different trail home where we had to come across the train tracks. Hopefully, it's not too windy, but we found a spot where the train derailed. And apparently, when the train derails, they just rip up the broken part of the tracks and leave the train there. This has been here for a while. This happened quite a while ago. I thought I'd walk up here real quick and check it out. We got a little crazy with the bikes today. You guys have seen we've been doing some reviews. I've had, you guys know I've had this scooter for a while. 
this is one of the new bikes that we've been reviewing so we thought we'd uh, take it out for a ride I'll put some links and stuff for it down below as well this one's got full suspension what do you think of that bike hon huh? yeah that one's nice <laughs> yeah it's uh, a yeah. step above yeah I like that color it's pretty cool we're out here at Isaacson Bay Ooh, listen to this car as it goes by that's a Mustang <laughs> But we came out to Isaacson Bay and now the debate is do we keep going that way? There's there's like a trail, bike trail, back to the earth that way. I don't want to be gone for too long, but I think we're over halfway there. Yeah, right. I don't think it's taking us that long. No, I think we might try it. <laughs> I think we might try it. My bike might tell me how long we've been gone. Yeah. Does your bike tell you how long you've been gone? Twenty-three minutes, we went six miles. Okay. Alright, well. Maybe we'll keep going. Hey, look, there's a sign right above you. I know. Did you see that? I didn't see that. No, I, I don't think that's a new sign from the last time I was out here. But it's also going to tell them what we're going to see. Yeah. <laughs> we rode all the way back here to come see the cracks in the earth. Sometimes we bring the dogs back here, but this can be a pretty treacherous plate. I literally stepped there and my foot almost went through. Yeah. Be careful. This is one of those treacherous places to bring the dogs. So I don't always like to bring the dogs here, but I like to come back here and check it out. Because, look, there's like giant cracks in the earth. Check this out. I swear these look different every time I come out here. You can see they go that way. And this, the earth is just splitting apart, falling that way. There's a sinkhole over there underwater. Yeah, here, I'll give you a Are you going to come down? Yeah, come stand. I don't know if you can get down from there. Oh, I thought you were going to come stand in it. I down, yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah, come stand in it, because right now it does not look like much. But mind you, Jamie is six foot one, and now he's, yeah. Yeah, it still goes down quite a ways. Oh, it's all squishy. Is it buggy down there? Uh, maybe. <laughs> oh, one found me. Yeah, these are pretty cool. Yeah, it keeps going. You can literally just walk right through there. Pretty cool. So you can look down there. See how deep that crack is and it just keeps on going. It's so crazy. You can walk along the edge of it for quite a ways. So this is Elkajan Bay and Jamie and I have been out here when the, you could pretty much walk across this. The sinkhole is over there under the water and sometimes you can actually walk to the edge of it but apparently not right now. Yeah and there's a couple natural springs. There's one that way. I think we can get down to it from that way. I don't know if you can. And it might be too high. We might not even be able to tell that it's oh, there. Oh yeah. I bet you won't be able to tell. Yeah we walked all the way out there one time and placed a geocache. Yeah, now actually you... I think we walked straight across this. Yeah now you can't even walk <laughs> it. This would be a fun place if you guys could get in here to With bring the kayaks. kayaks. Yeah, it might be so you could actually like go to the sinkhole. Yeah. I wouldn't want to drag it down that path. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> yeah. Maybe not. So this is the path that takes us down to the water where we just were. But I thought I would show you. There's a whole bunch of spots along here. There's just great big cracks in the earth. You don't want to fall down in there. That one actually goes that way. You can see the big divot right there. And if we walk up this way, there's some more. You can see this one right over here. That's a pretty good sized one as well. Peek over down here. Let's see? Big old crack. And then it crosses, the path crosses right here. But that crack comes right across and goes into the woods that way. You can see it just shoots down that way. I know, uh, there's a lot of down trees right yeah, I here. Think it, I think the path is there. Yeah, the I still think it's that path up here that takes us way down that way, but there's a bunch of down trees. I thought it was really close to these cracks right here. I thought so too. We were looking for another area we remember where there was some big cracks, but we haven't really been back here all that often recently. So we might find it, we might not. Also, so far, no bruise. I can still feel it. I still haven't even told Jamie, but so far, no bruise. <laughs> wow, you got a nice uh, sunbeam behind you. <laughs> what are you wowing about, the trees? Yeah, I was looking at the moss. Oh, this tree, this is like yeah. Moss. Yeah, look at this. It's climbing all over this tree. Yeah, it's because the tree's dead. So we found the path that the tree is down over and we think this is the path we used to take. And I think I can get your scooter over this way. That scooter's like 80 pounds, but I believe in you. <laughs> uh, yeah, true. So my scooter made it, but that's the path. Oh, look, 
Look, there's Jamie. Thanks, hon. So now he's gonna go all the way back and get his bike. But then we just look straight in front of us and there's already another tree down. So apparently nobody's been back here taking care of this trail. So we were already talking that maybe like sometime next week or maybe even this weekend if it's nice, we might bring the saws back here and clean all this up because it's... I hear you coming! Because it's pretty wild. And even for walking, like it's gonna be a hard walking path. You're doing it! Is that one easier to push than my scooter? I feel like it doesn't get hung up on everything. Yeah, higher ground clearance. Yeah, so are you gonna go do this one first? Yeah, sure. Ah, see you later. See how you make it through this. How bad is it? The debate on if we go that way or the other way. We gonna make it? Yeah. All right, we're going. You gonna cross the river on your bike? I'm doing it. All right. Like I said, the other side might Look at them red flowers. I know, I saw them. Right? They're like everywhere. This is so pretty. So this is the makeshift bridge that you can walk across. <laughs> which is sketchy as all get up. We're lucky that the river is kind of low right now. Yeah, you're going for it? Yeah. Go for it. You made it! I don't think you're doing that with my scooter. No. Um, I mean, you might get hung up on that rock and that board. You can try. <laughs> Oh, wait, am I doing? Yeah, I was gonna... <laughs> oh, my scooter's back here. I'm going to look at the river over here. It's very pretty. Creek. It's a creek. It's a crick. Whoa, what was that? Something made noise over there. Did you hear it? I don't know. All right, I'm coming this way for a minute. Because this is really pretty. It is. This river is always pretty. Yeah. It just keeps flowing down. Yeah. Like, there's a little mini waterfall right here. It's just a pretty area. It's deep right here. Is it? Yeah. Like, probably up to at least your knees. Oh, okay. Like, comparatively to what we right. just went across. Oh, if yeah. you stepped in right there, you'd be up to your knees. Yeah. There's a little, there's more of them red flowers. <laughs> little mini waterfall. People made that to cross right there. Probably. Yeah, I think so. All right, let's try to get my scooter across. Your feet are already wet. No, they're not. I stay dry. It does wobble. The whole thing. It bounces. Yeah, there you go. Don't go from board to board to board. Go from board to log to board to log. There you go. Uh huh. Yeah, really. Before the planks were there, it really them two trees really bobbed up and down. I did it. You did it. You did it. The the. Red flower encouraged you the whole way. Yeah. <laughs> right? I almost did too. You, you neither. Because it's muddy here. So it's pretty though. The creek is really pretty if you walk down there. So we made it across the river and uh Jamie parked my scooter right here so I could see these. Look at these mushrooms. So Jamie says you're normally the bright colored mushrooms mean they're poisonous. Again, don't eat mushrooms from the woods unless you really know what you're doing. We don't eat mushrooms from the woods unless they're morels, but these are so cool looking. I don't even want to step on them. I'm going to step over here. That's why I didn't dive over. Yeah, somebody was having a fire right here. But then I also noticed, well, there's more over here. There's these little purple flowers everywhere. Mm. They're just everywhere. So. Hey, hon! There's more down trees. Uh. <laughs> here we go. Uh-oh. I don't know if I can reach my hand up in here. Or not. I have smaller hands than you. Let's see, I'm mean, zip tied here so it ain't coming backwards to us. So we came over this last little log. The road that we need to get on is right there. And the scooter, unfortunately, the way the wires go to the motor, when we came over the log, the log snagged. You can see the wires down here. The log snagged the wires and unplugged something. So let's see what we can figure out. Otherwise, Jamie's got a long ride home to come back and get me. <laughs> I like tools! Thanks, Dad! Is that the set Robert got you? No, uh, no, this came up. Oh, okay. Well, thanks, Dad, anyway. <laughs> well, we found the culprit. We actually did rip some wires out. Good thing Jamie knows what he's doing. Because I sure don't! <laughs> All part of the adventure. Okay, so Jamie did his thing. 
Mr. Fix It. And he just put the battery on and we're gonna turn this. And if this light comes on, we should be good. Are you watching? I'm watching. Okay, Yay! I think we can make it home. I'm gonna turn it back off while you finish putting it together. Okay, I gotta hold this for Jamie so he can put it back together. Good job, hon. And that's why it's important to bring tools. Yeah. Ooh, yeah, it's warm. I know we're kind of in the sun. You were kind of like, right? We could have moved up here and been in the shade a little bit, but. Yeah, I yeah. guess. Yeah, yeah. uh -huh. We'll be moving soon. All right, let's go. We have power. We're on the road again. So there's the quarry. Oh, go way up there, you can see it. And there's the cement plant. Whew, how far have we gone? Uh, I don't think it was actually that. Are you sure? Because my feet and hands feel it. Right? It's only saying like 12 miles, but I think I started at a mile or two short, so oh. I like 14. Oh, okay. Not too bad. Oh, we're making our way back home. Yeah. Gotta go hang out with the dogs. Yep. Let's go. Yeah. Look at it. So <laughs> from here, we Let's actually see. have a view. Yeah, so you can see a little better here. Yeah. Wow. Hi, dear. Oh, on the big grass. There's a deer there. over there in the grass. He's jumping. So anyway, that's the quarry. That's pretty cool. I guess I didn't realize there was that good of a view right here. I think we just zip by in the car and never even notice it. Yeah. Huh. There's the quarry for you. Well, hun, I guess we know the range of both the scooter and the bike because they both died. Jamie's died first and at least he can pedal his. Mine, that's the first time I've killed it, but yeah. it it is dead. So... We called somebody to come give us a ride. <laughs> and we're home! Yeah. Eric's wife was kind enough to come pick us up and give us a ride home so we didn't have to try to... Well, you could have pedaled, but I'd have, yeah, had, to, I figured it out, I'd yeah. have had to walk. Jamie could have pedaled all the way home, but <laughs> we saw them right before the bikes died, so we knew they were out and about, and that worked out perfect. All right, let's go see the dogs. Oh my goodness! Oh, you saw Eric's truck, and now you think Lana's here. Lana's not here. And Eric's not here. They are just dropping us off. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Crazy girl. So after all that insanity and all that craziness, we're home, but we promised you girls we would do something with you. So even though we're exhausted after all that, I guess we're going for a walk. Hun, there's a rainbow on the wall again. There's a rainbow. Hey, do you wanna go for a walk? Oh my goodness, hi. What, I'm not chew -onable. I didn't ask if you wanted to chew on me. There's nothing in my hand. You don't understand. Get down. Tell me. <laughs> yeah? We, that's not telling me. That's trying to eat the camera. You gonna tell me? How about you? You gonna tell me? I saw you do the stomps. She's like, yeah. Well, let's go for a, let's go for a walk. Ready? You wanna go for a walk? Okay. Let's go for a walk. Let's go. Well, there's a really pretty car out front. I don't think you guys can see it. I think it was a charger. Just drove by. Are you already yelling, huh? We just got out here. You can't yell yet. Oh, they're in front of you. She's like, I need to be the lead dog. We're getting there. We're getting there. Eleanor, you've effectively set off all the neighbor dogs. I hear Georgie barking. I hear Chloe over here barking. Chloe's yelling at you. Hi, Chloe. Yeah, you set everybody off. Good job. <laughs> wow, I, I, didn't, I didn't even get to see the bunny. It ran away so fast. I don't know why it ran away so fast. What do you think, hon? It, it's way up there. As soon as they hear you talk, they're like, yes, we can talk. Yeah, they're like, oh, yeah, make all the noise. There's the bunny. Way up there. Oh, my gosh. The neighbors know we're walking. <laughs> oh, yeah, hon, I forgot to tell you something. What's that? I, I told the vlog. Uh, if I get a bruise underneath my eye, it's because I punched myself in the face. I, I heard. Yeah, I was, it was a big bug. I think it was a bee or a wasp. I don't know. What? Yeah, it was in the backyard. Oh. And I like did the hand you, swing thing. You didn't tell me how you did it. Yeah. yeah I've done that before. I got yeah. stung in the face by a bee. That's and, pretty much what it was. It yeah. touched my face and my hand went to my face. And, yeah. But so far I don't have a bruise, so I think we're good. <laughs> but then I got smacked in the face by a tree while we were in the woods, so. Yeah, I got hit in the legs. Anyway. Yeah, I don't think everybody saw your, that's oh the other side. Yeah. The little scratches. Yeah, when Corey dropped us off, she was like, oh my gosh, Jamie, you're bleeding. <laughs> and he's like, oh yeah, that's dry. Yeah. <laughs> it was. What do you think, girls? Are you happy now? They're like, yeah, we happy now. It is, a, it is warm, but it's way nicer than it was earlier, yeah, so. I, yeah, me too. But look at we still took the girls out for fun, which is what they wanted. Did you see any more bunnies, Elnor? I don't see any over there. 
She was like, guys, the bunnies are usually right here, but I don't see none. I don't know, I have to keep looking. As I say, Kira's like, there was a squirrel, guys. You know where that squirrel just was, hon? Yeah. Probably stealing the chipmunk's peanuts. Oh, yeah. Because he ran across the street. I missed him on camera, but he ran across the street. You're right. I bet he was eating the peanuts. Yeah. Right. Look, girls, we did it. I don't know what you're looking at. There's nothing over there. There's no bunny over there. there okay, maybe there was one here. I don't know. Come on, let's go. So, Jamie and I just tried to calculate how many miles we actually went because he accidentally reset the trip meter at one point in time. So we don't know exactly, but we tried to like track it out with Google Maps and figure out where we went and blah, 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 blah. And then where the batteries died. Because then of course we got a ride home and we're estimating we went anywhere between 22 and 25 miles, which is crazy. Ma'am, did you just, you just stole that one? That was for Memphis. It was not for you. My goodness. Here you go, lady. It's like, oh, thanks, Mom. But anyway, we are going to go ahead and call it a night. It, it, the day I'm filming this is Friday. I still have not heard anything about Memphis's test results that she had on Monday. But the vet called today, and I got all excited because I thought that's what it was. And it was just a reminder that Kira has a dental appointment on Monday. So, Kira, don't forget you're going to get your teethers cleaned on Monday. Are you going to be a grumpy dog or not a grumpy dog? I guess we're going to find out. All right, you guys. We hope you enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. We will see you again soon. Good night, audience. Kira, you stole a second treat. I'm not even gonna give you one when you go to bed. Okay, I, I will, I will give you one. We just won't tell anybody. Good night, audience.